हेलो स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डू एक्सरसाइज 5.1 क्वेश्चन नंबर 4 व्हिच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग आर एपीज इफ दे फॉर्म एन एपी फाइंड द कॉमन डिफरेंस डी एंड राइट द थ्री मोर टर्म्स सो इन दिस द फर्स्ट पार्ट इज 2 4 8 16 एंड सो ऑन फर्स्ट थिंग दैट वी नीड टू चेक इज इफ इट इज एन एपी फॉर अ सीरीज टू बी एन एपी दे शुड हैव अ कॉमन डिफरेंस between each of its consecutive terms which means if my a2 minus a1 a3 minus a2 and a4 minus a3 all of this comes equal then i can say that this particular series is in ap so let's begin here a1 is 2 a2 is 4 a3 is 8 and a4 is 16 so a2 minus a1 that is 4 minus 2 is 2 a3 minus a2 that is 8 minus 4 that is 4 and a4 minus a3 that is 16 minus 8 is 8 as you can see that all these three are different terms so definitely this is not an ap this is not an arithmetic progression second part 2 comma 5 by 2 comma 3 comma 7 by 2 again in this this is a1 a2 a3 and a4 to check ki koi bhi series ap mein hai ya nahi we need to check the difference between the second and the first term third and the second term fourth and the third term and so on agar ye difference same hai तब हम इसे कॉमन डिफरेंस बोलेंगे एंड देन इन दैट केस दिस सीरीज विल बी इन ए पी बट अगर वो डिफरेंट आता है तो दिस इज नॉट एन अर्थमेटिक प्रोग्रेशन सो ए टू इज फाइव बाई टू माइनस टू टू कैन बी टेकन एज अ कॉमन डिनोमिनेटर वी आर गेटिंग हाफ एज द ए टू माइनस ए वन वैल्यू ए थ्री माइनस ए टू दैट इज थ्री माइनस फाइव बाई टू so this will be 6 minus 5 this is also coming as half a4 minus a3 so that is 7 by 2 minus 3 or 7 minus 6 even this is coming half as you can see that we are getting the common difference as half in the question they have also asked to write three more terms so the first term is 2 then 5 by 2 then 3 and then 7 by 2 so next three terms that is a5 will be equal to a4 plus half that is 7 by 2 plus half or 8 by 2 that is 4 a6 the sixth term will be 4 plus 1 by 2 that is equal to 9 by 2 and the next term that is a7 which will be equal to a6 plus d that is 9 by 2 plus d is half which is 10 by 2 and that is 5 so these are the next three terms of the ap third part minus 1.2 minus 3.2 minus 5.2 and minus 7.2 So if we do a2 minus a1, that is minus 3.2 minus of minus 1.2, this becomes minus 3.2 plus 1.2, and that is equal to minus 2. If we do a3 minus a2, then that is equal to minus 5.2 minus minus 3.2. which is equal to minus 5.2 plus 3.2 which will again come as minus 2 if we do a4 minus a3 a4 is minus 7.2 minus minus 5.2 this will be minus 7.2 plus 5.2 and this is again coming as minus 2 so as we can see that all of this are equal so therefore the common difference d is equal to minus 2 we also need to find the next three terms in this case so the next three term 
if we talk of a5 that will be equal to a4 plus d and a4 is minus 7.2 so this next term will be minus 7.2 plus minus 2 that is minus 9.2 a6 will be a5 plus d which is minus 9.2 plus minus 2 that is minus 11.2 and a7 will be a6 plus d which is minus 11.2 plus minus 2 that is minus 13.2 so these are the next three terms fourth part minus 10 minus 6 minus 2 2 So if we do a2 minus a1 that is minus 6 plus sorry minus 6 minus minus 10 which is minus 6 plus 10 and it's coming as 4. If we do a3 minus a2 that is minus 2 minus minus 6 or minus 2 plus 6 which is coming 4 and a4 minus a3 that is your 2 minus minus 2 which is 2 plus 2 is also coming 4. So we can see that the common difference is 4. This thing is in AP or the arithmetic progression. A5 will be A4 plus D and A4 is 2. So 2 plus 4, the next term is going to be 6. A6 will be A5 plus D which will be 6 plus 4 and that will be 10 and A7 will be a6 plus d which is 10 plus 4 which is 14. So these are the next three terms in the AP. Fifth part 0 0.2, 0 0.22, 0 0.222, 0 0.2222. So let's do a2 minus a1 that is 0 0.22 minus 0 0.2. This will be 0 0.02. If we do a3 minus a2, that is 0 0.222 minus 0 0.22, this is coming as 0 0.002. And if we do a4 minus a3, that is 0 0.2222 minus 0 0.222, that will come as 0 0.0002. So as you can notice, all these three terms or differences are coming different. Therefore, there is no common difference here and this is not in arithmetic progression. Part 7, 0, minus 4, minus 8, minus 12. So let's do a2 minus a1 that is minus 4 minus 0 which is minus 4. If we do a3 minus a2 that is minus 8 minus minus 4 that is minus 8 plus 4 which is also minus 4. a4 minus a3 that is minus 12 minus minus 8 minus minus will become plus 8 and this is also minus 4. As we can see that minus 4 is the common difference here and this thing is in AP. So let's find the next terms. A5 is equal to A4 plus D that is minus 4 plus minus 4 which is coming as 0. So the next term here, okay I'm sorry I took A4 as minus 4. A4 here is minus 12 so minus 12 plus minus 4 this is minus 16 a6 that will be a5 plus d a5 is minus 16 so minus 16 plus minus 4 which is minus 20 and a7 which is a6 plus d that is minus 20 plus minus 4 it's minus 24 so minus 16, minus 20 and minus 24 are the next three terms of this AP. Eighth part, 
minus half minus half minus half and minus half now in this a2 minus a1 is coming as minus half minus minus half which is 0 a3 minus a2 that is minus half minus minus half so which is minus half plus half again is 0 and a4 minus a3 is minus half minus minus half or minus half plus half is again coming 0 so we can see from these three that the common difference d is 0 here and since the common difference d is 0 a5 can be written as a4 plus d or which is minus half plus 0 again minus half a6 will be a5 plus d which is minus half plus 0 again minus half and a7 which is a6 plus d is minus half plus 0 which is again minus half so this is an ap will all the terms as minus half and common difference as 0 ninth part 1 comma 3 comma 9 comma 27 a 2 minus 7 that is 3 minus 1 is 2 a 3 minus a 2 that is 9 minus 3 is 6 and a 4 minus a 3 that is 27 minus 9 is 18 so as you can see all the differences are coming different here we are getting 2, 6, 18. Since the common difference is not same, this is not in AP. Or this is not in arithmetic progression. Tenth A, two A, three A, four A. So A two minus A one, that is two A minus A is A. A three minus A two, that is three A minus two A, that is A. And A four minus A three, that is four A minus three A, is again A. Here the common difference is A, and this is in AP. So to find the fifth term, we will do a4 plus d and a4 is 4a, 4a plus a, this is 5a. The sixth term is a5 plus d, which is 5a plus a, that is 6a. And the seventh term is a6 plus d, which is 6a plus a, which is 7a. So 5a, 6a and 7a are the next three terms of this AP.